finally we made it. Holy cow, man. We are finally live here at Lowe's. What's up, guys? Jeff here. Okay, so what an interesting five minutes I just had here trying to get this thing to go live here. So apparently when you try to do it through streaming through their internet Wi-Fi here, it just, whatever reason, doesn't work with YouTube very well. But I came in here specifically because I drove across, all the way across town to a different Lowe's that I normally go to to show you this one, uh, there's a couple of uh, deals I wanted to show you, but there was a nice blowout deal here on this Cobalt two-tool combo kit. So I don't know if you guys were aware of this particular kit that's being clearanced out. So I thought I'd bring it to your attention. And uh, so this is the kit here, and I'm surprised they have it here on the floor because some of the stores don't. Hey, what's up, Omar? So this is the kit here. So, so there's your clearance. So you see how it says 152 was 179? This was actually a $279 kit. If you go and bring this up online right now, there's your SKU number for Lowe's, 079022. If you bring this up online right now, it'll say 279. But if you come into the individual stores, they're clearanced out. And at this store, it's 152. Now I'm here at the Pompano Beach Lowe's in Pompano Beach, Florida on um, Federal Highway, south of Sample. Now this is way across from town where I live because the Lowe's near me does not have this in stock. So this is a pretty incredible deal because to get it at 152 from 279 is what it says on the website right now. You're talking $125 off or something like that. Yeah, this is the last one in here. So there's only one here in this particular store. And I don't know if it gives you just one battery or not. I hate to, it's a tool tool. It's got the hammer drill in it, five year or three year on the warranty. And it does have the bag and the charger. I just don't, uh, let me see if I can gently turn it around without, without pissing off the green turtle here and making him go nuts. And it would be upside down, of course. So anyway, and it's so tiny and it's way dark in here. I can't even read the thing if I wanted to. Let me see if I can pull him out. I just hate moving these things. Yeah, see, there he goes. Oh, yeah. Pissed off the green turtle. Yeah, man. So, anyway, let me tell you guys what happened in here five minutes ago. I don't know if you saw that we tried to do a live stream, but it wasn't but it wasn't going. And then there was this dude that was right behind me over here in the tool section right here. And he comes running by me. He has a cart like this filled with a bunch of Bosch tools, like up to here, right here. And he goes running right down there, and he goes right out the friggin' door with it, right? And uh, an employee went ringing out behind him, and it's dumping down rain, and all the employees are running up front and out the front door. They, they're not allowed to stop him or something. But he got video and pictures of the guy's license plate, and you could see this guy get in the car, and his buddy was in there with him, and they just skidded out of here like a bat out of hell. So I'm sure the cops are called and have a bolo out looking for these guys right now. But that was pretty kind of gnarly because this dude was right by me. He almost banged into my cart. He was zooming to walk out of here as fast as he could. And that was his problem, I think. He drew too much attention to himself. He just went right down the midway and to the left, right out the front door. Just very brazen. That's what they do here. I got a friend who's a manager at a grocery store, I think up in Georgia somewhere. And, he, and all the time, they catch people walking out the door with carts full of steaks and beer. All right, so... There was something else I wanted to show you while I'm in here. So we talked about that, okay? And that is uh, not every store has them. So if you were looking for a good two-tool combo kit, man, there you go, 150. And then while we were here, since we're at this particular Lowe's, and let me just stop for a second while I'm positioning to aim up for you and see what we got here. And Omar says, if I buy that DeWalt, that Lowe's DeWalt kit, clearance and the price goes lower will they give me the difference that's what i don't know on clearance stuff whether they do that or not and stan says jeff what's up did you get my email with the dewalt flexible advantage model numbers yeah yesterday yeah so i think all those tools we were looking at up top on on the home depot live stream yesterday were the advantage okay now i want to direct your attention right there you see that stack of four dewalt kits right there so this Lowe's has four of those. That's that, that three-tool woodworking kit that I told you guys about. And the SKU number here at Lowe's, and I'll tell, I will tell this story a million times if I have to. Every time I'm in here, I will tell you guys about this 
this three tool kit. So there's your kit number there, 2537952. And that's the that kit that I bought I, I, in August. And I told, I've been telling you guys about this since August, but um, as long as there's some left, and because you have to come into the store and they're only kept up top, the employees don't even know th those are up there. They don't even know. And that's the kit that has the jigsaw, the sander, and the multi-tool cordless. And the jigsaw alone is normally $199, the sander is $129, and the multi-tool is $129. And they're selling this whole kit for $299. And you get two 4 amp hour batteries that are worth $120 each, plus the charger, and plus the, the uh, souped up bag. The tool bag that comes with that is one of their better bags, you know. And and Brazil is asking which store. I'm at the Pompano Beach low. So this is way across town from where I'm I live. And so I figured I would show you guys again. Every time I walk into a Lowe's and I see those up top, I will point those out to you. And this is what you have to do. You have to come in and tell the employee, I want one of those. And they have to get a ladder and go get it for you because there is no stock on the floor. There's no which is really strange. I don't know why they don't at least have a, a sample on the floor there. By the way, I love setting off those green turtles. <laughs> oh, yes. All right, let me see what else we've got. So, let me see. Damasa123 says HD employees can pull up the prices on those new DeWalt Advantage tools. So $199 for the beer tool and $399 for the drill impact combo kit. Yeah. Is Bosch going away to online only? Asks Penniless Plantation. Well, we don't know. I've heard those rumors circulating around, but I haven't heard anything concrete about that. And then Stan the Man says the new Ridge Advance is on the Home Depot website. I saw you mention it during the stream yesterday, but I did not see it there. Hey, and you know what else? Is this store has two different planers here from DeWalt. The other Lowe's near me, I think only has that one. But this store has the other one, and of course, neither one is on sale. This one is still $5.99. This one is still $4.49 here. And I found a couple of interesting deals while I was walking around here a little while ago. Everything here is still the same. That Nothing's changed on the on the table saws or anything, still waiting for, see, here's the issue here with the Metabo. They're out of stock right now, so they don't, they don't even have it. Forget about paying full retail, they don't even have it. And I have a feeling is that once they come back in stock, maybe they'll drop back down to 349 again, like we showed you back at the beginning of August. And about 60 of you informed us that you were able to take part of that deal. Um, more ridiculousness here we have the dewalt fan at 119 and i don't even think that's a kit that's a tool only at 119. <laughs> somebody doesn't want to sell anything uh, here they have a display of the the 779 this is their their miter saw that everybody only says oh hey yeah yeah the 780 is on sale for 399 no it's the 779 this is the only one that we can do a that they're, they're allowed to do the promotional deal on to drop from 549. The 780, which is the one that has that XPS lighting system on it, they can't ever discount that one. They're not allowed to. Um, everything, yeah, all this other stuff is still the same. I don't think anything changed here. So I'm not gonna cover that. We just covered that the other day. Um, all these kit prices are the same. I wanted to show you something down here towards the craftsman land so again this store too finally uh, caught up to the other store near me and got the the new uglier packaging for the box wrenches uh, this table we don't have at our lows but look at this man 949 that's a lot of money that's like huge amount of money for that i don't know if we've ever seen this one on sale I, I, my lows doesn't get this one so I don't know. Uh, are they dropping that price down? Any? No, that's only like 10 bucks off on those. Yeah, so we showed these a couple of weeks ago. 
All of these tool kits, same price, nothing's changed there. Now we do have here, 364 piece bag set is $99. That's a cobalt bag set. So this one, like if your kid's buying a new place or moving into their first apartment, you get them this and it's got every tool they'll ever possibly need as a homeowner or DIYer. See, $99. Now they have this lesser priced one here. It's 118 piece for $50. But this is basically only sockets. Whereas if you double that price and you're willing to spend more, I mean, you're going to get everything you'd never need. You got wire strippers here. Almost these are almost like channel locks, needle nose. You got wire cutters, everything, hammer, utility knife, all your Allen wrenches, anything you could possibly need or would ever find yourself using in a as a new homeowner. And this is still not dropped in price i don't I mean you know this is bogus right here you see what it says 29.98 was 44. i've never seen this at 44 bucks ever in here every time i've ever seen this kit it was always 29.98 it was never 44.98 so this isn't really theoretically on sale because that's the price it always is whenever they bring it in so just wanted to warn you about that uh, I think I saw a couple of bargains down the storage area here. Let me see if there's this one, nothing here. I think it was on the next next row. Okay, so here we go. So this Craftsman, this is the 37-inch four drawer. So I think it's just the upper section. So it's just this guy right here. Okay, and this is 279 but it, it's actually just a new lower price. It's not really on sale. It's a new lower price for you. pretty cool so let's see Kimberly says Dixon Tennessee store has the woodworking kits if anyone needs via online does it show the 299 price in there hey Brandon welcome look for the blower vac combo please let me see what they got over here junior we'll see if they got anything uh, the cobalt kit includes the one four amp hour battery and wow you got that kit for 125 yeah see when it's clearance guys you might find it cheaper in a different store depending on which store you're in so that's the thing about that you know those yellow sticker clearance items can be a different price in each store this one um they don't have this at our lowes but i like this this is kind of cool so this is 39.98 it's an led under cabinet light so it's 18 inches 600 lumens and what I like about it is it comes with two USB ports right there and a three-prong outlet. So if you ended up with like three of these in a row across like over four feet of your under counter space, you could theoretically be powering and charging in six USBs and three plug-in devices. See, with a lot of your flashlights and stuff nowadays, they're starting to charge by USB a lot you have a lot of tools and stuff that charge by usb now so it'd be cool to have that okay and then coming down the aisle i saw a couple of other yellow stickers here earlier uh where were they are oh, so we have this one here you got this cart here five drawer cart and it's 189 down from 249 all right and then we get this guy. One, two, three, four. It's another, this is the five drawer top. This is a 26 inch wide five drawer chest. So he is 159. Okay. And he's got that nice lid on him too. Let me go to the end of the comments, see what's coming up. And we have William gave us a $5 Super chat, thank you so much, William. Every little bit helps because you guys know how many tools we buy and test on a regular basis. Let's see. Uh, they did have a couple of vacs over here. And then we'll head over towards the OPA and see if they got there for, for blows. And I'm still wondering, folks, why nobody has come out with a walk behind edger, a uh, cordless one, you know, battery operated. All right, so there's their four gallon wet dry, 
It's a decent size. See, I like these big switches on the top. I got really sick of my old shop vac one. And let me see if they move the shop vacs over here. Because I am not going to go hunting them down. Oh, I think they're over here. In this store. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens here with the shop vac space. Or does somebody come and buy them out? So we still have plenty of shop vacs here. They probably weren't selling them anyway, which is probably why the company was hurting. They had so many cash flow problems. Plus, in addition to laying off 400 people last week, you know, they they laid off a couple of hundred February of last year up in New York. Yeah. All right, so Stan says, just got the presses for the DeWalt Flex Float Advantages. All right. Roll the R's says, thanks for the video. All right, so we're heading over towards OPE, and there was a, a couple of things I wanted to look at on the way over there real quick. So, yeah, and I, oh, the other thing I came over here for is, do you guys remember that DeWalt two-tool combo kit, just like I showed you the, the Cobalt one here at the beginning? That DeWalt one that I showed you the other day at my Lowe's, but they were sold out? Here... The guy, said, he seems to think that there's one here, but at this store, it scans in at 3.30, which is really strange. Because after we did that live stream last week, a lot of you guys responded back saying, hey, I was able to buy that. And one guy bought it in San Antonio, 178. Um, all over the country, I was getting different quotes from different people. So it really depended on your store. So check your Lowe's, look for that DeWalt kit and if I have time before we leave, we'll we'll show it to you. And um, uh, some people said, yeah, 175. I had a couple of people say 154 for a kit that shows up as 389. At my store, it said 389 on the shelf, and it, you'll see it online, 389. But don't go by that price because when you get into the store, it's going to be less. Okay. And so in my store, it was 252, but they just didn't have any. I came into this store and it says 3.30. I don't understand why there's such a, a wide disparity. Okay. So. Uh, there's really no discounts on any of the mowers right now. Here. Not in this store. Um, but. We do have. This is one of those real mowers there. 16 inch push if you're really into punishment there and you really want to work hard knock yourself out but that's in terms of the lawnmower type stuff here that's really all they've got there uh, see if your Lowe's has the craftsman chop saw for 67 regularly 149 yeah when we head back over that way we'll see I'm gonna see if any of these prices have changed since last week now see we still got this one here at 99, the Cobalt, the 24 volt blower. And then we got the 40 volt one, it's still 139, $20 off. So that one hasn't changed. You got a 60 volt. That's, see, that doesn't make it. Well, it's on clearance right now. But I'm willing to bet if, if you scan it in, it might show up lower because sometimes the clearance items just slowly drop lower in price. But, you know, this is Greenworks, and I haven't been too impressed with them, so I really don't believe that 610 CFM number there. I just don't believe that. I mean, it might be true, but um, call me a skeptic. Oh, wait a minute. I see a sticker. I see a sticker. Oh, uh, that's a... They're, their leaf uh, gas one here. Yeah, so this is 129 from 139. So usually when you come here, a normal sale is like $10 off of something here. But when they're clearancing it, that's when you see all sorts of strange stuff. Like this one here, here's your brushless kit. And I'm pretty sure we showed you this one last week too. This is the 13 inch trimmer with the blower. And this guy is 155. And, you know, so if you're looking to come buy something now for outdoors, this is the stuff I would get, like your kits. It's got two of them in there. 
right? For just a lot more savings. Here you got an 80 volt max cobalt kit. This one is 258. So that's more than $100 off. Okay. And by the way, this Lowe's here has some really nice inflatables that the one near my house doesn't have. Unless they just haven't put them up yet. But here, check these out here. Let me show you these across the top. Oh, let me show you there. That Santa over on the right is pretty choice looking there. Oh, so John Moraney was asking what company laid off people. That was the shop vac man up in Pennsylvania last week. Without warning, they, they laid off like 400 people up there. See, these are the nice looking inflatables here. And I got to show you this one up here, this. Uh, if I'm zoomed in too close, I can't get a, let me, let me get it to stabilize here for us. There's your, they got a helicopter going there. And so Roldy Ars was asking, what kind of garbage disposal do you recommend? I usually install the incinerators, and I would only get the ones that are stainless steel now. Um, if I'm doing it for somebody who doesn't really have a lot of money, you know, we, we get the $100 one. But they always will rust through and leak at the bottom. That Santa right up there has, like, nice furry looking on the outside. It's not some cheap looking inflatable stuff either. All right. Uh, so there wasn't a whole lot there that we didn't see already. Now, I want to check something over here because I thought I spotted some Schluter. And if that's true, it'd be, it'd be the first, yeah, it's the first time I've ever seen Schluter in stock here at Lowe's. It uh, doesn't say how much they're getting for it. Oh, there it is. It's $84.98 for a 54 square foot. Is that total 54 square foot? Yeah. So each one of these rolls of Ditra. It's $54.98 now. We did a video last summer where I remodeled my friend's bathroom upstairs. And this is a good uncoupling membrane. It's not a necessarily a crack isolation, but it is an uncoupling membrane that should help. Yeah. And weed trimmer. Hey, I like my DeWalt one. My FlexVolt one is a pretty nice one. I believe it's a 13 inch. Now this is funny now. It's, all right, so they have the Ditra. And I'm going to come over here and see if they had the other Schluter stuff. Because I want to see if they got any of the... See, the, they don't. But I, here's what I'm... This is what I'm seeing right over here. Now, this is funny. This is actually almost humorous, guys. So, so take a look at this. So I'm over here. They have no Curdy membrane. But they do have the rolls of the Curdy band, which is used to seal the end of the Curdy membrane. So that's like stupid. Why would you have this, but not the other stuff? I'm looking down the whole aisle. I checked all the other aisles. It's not there. And even dumber is this. They have the Schluter Curdy board screws. So these are the screws that we use to screw their Schluter Curdy panels to the shower walls, right? To make our tiling substrate. But they don't have the panel. So what are they doing selling the screws here for? It's like just brain dead. And this is nice here, but they don't have the whole housing for it. This is the the Schluter grill for the shower. It's a nice fancy grill there. But that's it. That's all they have in this whole store for Schluter. Nothing. I checked all of the other areas where there would be any kind of underlayments here. And there's nothing really strange that they would do that, you know. And Jamie says, the DeWalt combo kit is $252 in San Jose. I even asked the associate to scan it just to double check. Yep. So it's going to be different in different stores, folks. Depending on where you go, <clears throat> it's going to be different. And everybody's finding it all around the country except for me. You know, I was going to buy one here and do it as a tool giveaway. So I'm now in my second low store. And this store has one left in stock, but they're selling it for $3.30. So this store is way above all the other low stores in terms of the the cost on that so it's just not making much sense um so anyway for those of you who are just tuned in or didn't didn't uh, make it at the beginning here right as i was getting ready to go live and I'm, i was putzing with the the youtube app here to go live there was some dude comes flying by me over in the tool section where i'm parked in the middle of the tool section he comes flying by me bumps me with his cart 
and he's walking super fast and he's got it stacked up and I'm thinking something doesn't look right about this guy and he walks right out the freaking door with probably over a dozen large boxes of Bosch tools stacked up in this cart and I see a whole bunch of Lowe's employees go running out the door after him and they're out there getting video of him picture photos of his license plate and he took off like a bat out of hell man skidding around okay now check this out this is the clearance section here right and what i'm looking at here is i can't believe my eyes on how cheap some of this is i've seen this before at the one near my house where they'll take an entire box this is a 50 pound box of sinker nails coated 8d and look at that price man seven bucks and i'm willing to bet they might even scan in lower when you get up front because i had that happen last year when we had a hurricane coming and it missed us but it went to the bahamas and we went to lowe's and we bought a whole bunch of these roofing nail uh, type things and they were like way cheaper so all of these different nails you got here seven bucks seven bucks these are the scores that you want to look for look at it. here's some roofing nails now it doesn't show what the original price was on that one here's some 16 d's three and a half inch 22.49 that's like basically half price and another one here but i'm willing to bet some of these will drop when you get up to the counter there and you got a couple of led ceiling lights but no tools so i guess usually here lowe's just leaves the tools over where the tools are they don't bring them back here to the clearance section all right so i want to come back and show you this dewalt kit that i told you about in case any of you were unfamiliar with it and you want to see if it's on clearance in your area and just remember so far the lowest price that somebody has reported back to me this week guys was like $145. Insane. Totally insane. So then remember, this kit is $389 here, right? Now, in this store, it's accurate. So I tell everybody, just because it says $389 in your store, or even this number, you know, to always have them scan it. But in this store, it was correct. They are charging $330 for it. But there's your kit number. So this is that DeWalt Two Tool Kit. And we showed you this before, probably two weeks ago. And that's the kit number right there, DCK299M2. So you type that in on the Lowe's website, and who knows what it'll show. It'll likely show 389 but go into the store, find the box on the shelf here, and have somebody scan it and see what it comes in at. So at my store, by my house, this number became 252. You just saw a few guys here on the stream say it was 252 and you'll see other guys say it was um like 178 was one 175 and old squishy says jeff is the charger in the dewalt their better yellow one mentioned in the liking in the past no this one's the black charger it's the dcb i think it's the 115 and i've got plenty of those it's like every time i get one in a kit it's like put it on ebay Where's the charger? Uh, yeah, does it say? It's... It doesn't say the model number of the charger. But when you look at it online, they might have it online, they might tell you, but it's the black charger. It's not the yellow fast charger. And I picked up one of these already. I got to do a tool review on this one. I still got it sitting in the garage waiting. And Cody says, my Lowe's had the miter saw and stand combo kit for $249. Usually $699. He bought all four of them. Whoa. That's the way you do it. Discernment file says, I grabbed it for $202. Is that the DeWall kit you're talking about? You got it for $202 at your store? Okay. And I want to see if we have that Craftsman miter saw. That's that one somebody had asked about that let me see if they got it here so here we are 
and this one's 219 so that's probably not the one that we're, they were talking about and the other one here is 169 but he i think he was saying it was 69 bucks there's the item number i don't know if that's the same item number on it and then there was one other deal i wanted to show you here because every time i come in here and i show you guys this the other stores don't have the sticker on there to back it up we bought this a couple months ago i still haven't done the tool review yet on it but look it's down to 14.98 i think it was either 19.98 or i must have paid the full four when i bought it because we bought it to do the tool review video but never went around to it so let me show you i'll show you where that one is it is this one so i've, t I've showed you guys this a million times right but this is the one store that, that still has the sticker on it. See that? So you might be walking right by it, look at it and go, oh, that's $199, but it's really $129. On, on the website, I've seen it from $129. My store, they have it marked like that on the shelf at $199. But I'm pretty sure that if you bring it up to the register, it'll show up as $129. This is an unbelievable steal at that price. Because you get this is all metal. You got three drawers and the, then the top there. So my store does not show it that way with that. And all right. All right, so we've already did all these. Um, I want to see if they have those new Irwins. Yeah, see I got these here, this this Irwin vice grip here. We got these in last Christmas. I got them when they were on. I think it was like $21, maybe 19 even. It was a good Christmas price. But this was pretty decent. This thing proved itself because I was trying to undo at a friend's house underneath her vanity in the bathroom, trying to undo the uh, screws there for the faucet. And this was the only tool that it could get in there, reach it, clamp it, and, and undo it. So there you have it. So let's see if anybody else has any other questions. Yeah, I was looking for a good kitten saw miter saw <laughs> voice recognition huh oh wait so so ken says he put that in the lowe's app in salisbury maryland 233 yep so you're going to see that kit all over the pra the place and that's pretty much it you know i gotta uh, head over to a friend's house she's got a leak upstairs in her bathroom and so i'm gonna go take care of that for her tonight so if you guys didn't get anything your questions answered in this live stream wait for it to load up as a video in a few minutes and then you can leave a comment there or a question and i'll answer it for you but uh this was kind of a quick impromptu because i came all the way across town just to hunt down that cobalt and i'll show it to you one more time here um for those of you that didn't actually see it when we went live and that's way the heck down it's the cobalt two tool kits it's this kit right here. This is the whole reason why I drove all the way across town um, to get it, to look at it. Okay. Let me flip the thing around. So it's this kit right here. The two-tool combo kit. And it's marked down to 152. Okay, now it was previously 179, but this was a 279 kit. If you look on the Lowe's website right now, that kit is 279. And there's your kit number. So this store has one left of these. And probably most stores have one. The other stores in my area don't have it. Because they're out already. Because it's clearance. So um, the one near my house did not have it when I was in there yesterday looking. So that's what I've been going in and out of different Lowe's over the last few days. Trying to see if this was indeed a real deal or not. Because <clears throat> that's a clearance item. So that's a $279 kit right there for $152. And it's the last one here in this particular store here. All right. Well, listen, guys, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Uh, we're glad to have you here. And remember, any questions that weren't answered, just ask us later on, and we'll be glad to answer them for you. And we'll catch you guys all on the next one. See ya.